Chronicle, being a David is God eternal life. It means living forever without the death. Yeah. Living forever, praising Him. Yeah. Living forever, glorifying Him. Yeah. Because there is no other purpose of being human if not to glorify God. Okay. Okay. The Lord of the telling us that we are humans because we have to get all the degrees we can get. We are humans because we can achieve what we can achieve. No, we are humans because God wants glory. Yes, we are humans because, because God is the one who is the reason for what we exist. Yes. Yes. That's God come with a plan to redeem the world. Yes. As I said, that plan is through Jesus Christ. Yeah. So there are two ways I would like to express this. First, I will talk about the first coming of Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. Before Jesus could come, the way Galatians Pastor Ray told us. It was the right time. Why was it the right time? Because maybe God shift even and the movement of things in the world for that kind of time to happen. But when we read the history, we will see that many kingdoms rise and fall until the establishment of the uh, Roman Empire. When the Roman Empire was established, God saw that it was the right time for him to move forward with his plan. Uh -huh. And he brought the birth of Bethlehem. That Jesus Christ came into the world. Yeah. Jesus was not supposed to come as a, an extraterrestrial, but he had to come as a ordinary person. Yeah. Through the same way as any human being comes into the world. Yeah. So, with that, we saw that even at times was exact for Jesus to come into the world. Why? Because God saw that it was the right time. Yeah. And when Jesus came into the world, in Luke chapter 4, we read Jesus said, when he stood up to read Isaiah, he talked about the one year of God's grace. But he didn't say the second verse of Isaiah, which was one day of the vengeance. He limited it to the one year of the grace because that was his mission when he came to the, for his first coming. The first coming of Jesus Christ was the fullness of time for humanity to receive the grace, for humanity to receive the knowledge of God. That's right. And this leads to the second coming. Mm -hmm. The second coming, the time of fullness, is all about to happen. Mm -hmm. And this is, I think, below the time we are living. Why? Because in the beginning I told you what is going on in the world. Mm -hmm. We are seeing many things happening. Maybe with human intellect, uh, intellect, we can think that things happen because they have to happen. Mm -hmm. Things happen because it has always been like that. But as a believer, with God's perspective, we yeah. know that things happen because God shifted things around. Yeah. And why yeah. God shifted things around? Because He wants to fulfill something. Yeah. When God wants to accomplish something, He will do things happen that sometimes will be crazy. I was thinking about humanity today. We have gone so far in many things, good and bad. Yeah. Right. Take the example of uh, computer. Uh -huh. Computer is a device. If you ask someone who lived in the 19th century, maybe they still dream that today right. the humanity can know something that can unite the whole world just in a second. Right. The right. cell phone. Today I can talk with my family in Africa and say that. Before you can come to the church, I was speaking with my sister by text message. <laughs> so, humanity has come so far in the good and bad things. And that same computer today has spread the bad things too. Right. People, my dad, people, evil people don't have any more, they have an easy way now to, to, vehicle, to vehicle the message right. to yeah. computer, to internet. Pornography mm -hmm. is spreading among the down people. Yeah. Because of the computer and the internet. Right. So many things are happening in the world yes. that is showing us that we are heading to the time of the fullness. Mm -hmm. Or the yeah. fullness of the time. Yes. So we are witnessing many things, as I said, around the world that have to give us a hint of what God is about to do. Mm -hmm. right, right. The things are such as the rise of access. Mm -hmm. You know, if, uh, if you ask people who 
know the history of the world, it is difficult for something happened in the world to land. The country like the United States, France, Russia, United Kingdom, right. know what is really happening. Because they know things before even it can happen. Yeah. But the rise of crisis was something that surprised everybody. Nobody knew when that could happen. Mm -hmm. But today is the reality. If you ask someone who lived a long time ago, if we could assist in marriage between men and women, yeah. mm -hmm. the person would tell you that it was something they never dreamed. Yes. They never dreamed about it. Mm -hmm. But today, 